Do you think that becoming a marine engineer is the right choice today? Is it financially viable? Are there challenges involved for a mariner? Let us look at all of those things in this video. But let us first start from the role that a marine engineer will play. A marine engineer could play two major types of role. That is, either they can play a deck role or an engine role upon getting a job. If you get a deck role, your responsibilities will include bridge watch keeping, maneuvering of ship, general maintenance of deck equipment, shipping and painting of deck. Whereas if you get an engine role, your responsibilities will include engine watch keeping, maintenance of engine and related machineries. Now how do you become a marine engineer or how do you get into the field? All colleges for marine engineering in India are centralized through the Indian Maritime University. You will have to give an entrance test, clear a group discussion and a personal test. So after HSC, you can, you'll have to do all of this to enter into the field. You should also note that the fees for becoming a marine engineer is comparatively very high as compared to all other streams of engineering. A marine engineer would pay around 2 to 3 lakhs per year to become an engineer. However, if you are aiming for the deck side, you can do a 3 years BSc nautical science course and you can join any of the shipping industry. That is sufficient. If you want to join the engine side, however, they accept only a marine engineer. Now after passing out, generally, campus placement is offered to students. However, due to the recent crisis in the world economy, the demand for marine engineers has become very reduced thereby leading to lesser opportunities. One should however note that once you get a job opportunity, your starting salary will start somewhere around 600 to 800 USD, which is very high compared to all other streams of engineering. However, the work and the lifestyle of a marine engineer is not very easy. There are multiple cons involved such as you'll have a tough job which will involve a lot of manual labor. You will have a 24 hours job. You are required to be available for all the 24 hours. Whenever there's an emergency, you can't get away from the work environment. You will be living away from your family. You could fa face seasickness, loneliness, uncertainties in life as regards to job stability and money flow. The pros, however, are you'll get a lot of money, women, sense of independence, freedom, you'll get to travel around the world, meet new people and you'll have a 6 months job and 6 months holiday. As for the current market conditions, the demand is much lesser than the supply. There is a huge inflow of marinos from countries like China, Philippines, Indonesia, Vietnam, Egypt, Ghana, Ukraine, Russia, Montenegro, Romania, Cambodia, etc. There is far more competition and the salary has over the years reduced as a result of that. The conclusion would be that if you are you are ready to do heavy manual labor, you are okay with doing 24 hours job and you are okay with staying away from your family for 6 months, then you should definitely choose this stream. However, if any of these points do not suit you, you should prefer any other promising field of engineering. That's it. Thank you very much.